Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's me, Alan Ander, and the day has finally come. Apple has announced the iPhone 4, and just right now they have released the iOS 4 GM Seed. So, here are all the files for the GM Seed, and of course, iTunes 9.2 Beta, which I don't have all these things posted later today. But, for now, let me give you an overview of iOS 4, as Apple has renamed their um, iPhone operating system. And I believe there's a good reason why um, the iPad runs the iPhone OS, so there's no need to call it the iPhone OS anymore. So uh, that's the build for the final version of 4.0. It's 8A293, and it comes with AT&T Carrier version 7.0. So, um, quick things about the firmware. There's really nothing new from beta 4. Probably a lot of stability improvements and such. I haven't um, seen it slow down or crash at all for me. But of course it is a 3GS, so it's to be expected. Uh, let's see here. Let's go to the wallpapers. And I believe they're the same wallpapers Apple already provided before. So I don't see any new wallpapers. Maybe except for this one, but uh, that's because I don't recall. But uh, let's go ahead and switch to that wallpaper for both screens. And there we go. So we got a nicer wallpaper. Um, there's multitasking down there on the grill. Um, applications uh, like Pandora and stuff, they still do not background on this because the developers of iPhone apps need to uh, add all that multitasking stuff there. Uh, I also looked for the iBook store to see if it was available. It was, it's not available yet. Of course, the GM just came out like 20 minutes ago and I um, downloaded it and got it on my iPhone. So uh, just to show you guys the GM for the iPhone beta, there's really nothing that I should say new from previous betas. If you see my beta 3 and beta 4 video, I, I show more functionality, but everything's pretty much the same. I mean, it's just the first boot up of the entire uh, iPhone OS 4 screen. So, uh, this is just a short video of me showing you iOS 4 for the iPhone 3GS, and of course it's, it's available for the iPod Touch 2G and 3G, and of course the iPhone 3G without the uh, cool little features like multitasking and stuff. Alright, that's me, Alan Adder, with iOS 4 GM. It'll be available soon.